Hey cat lovers and welcome back to another video. While cats are typically more low maintenance than other pets, they still require lots of love and care. With that said, there are several things you should always do for your cat to ensure that it is happy, healthy, and loved. If you enjoy this kind of content, subscribe to the channel for more cat videos. Now let's reveal 11 things you should always do to provide your feline friend with a safe and happy home. Number 1. Keep food, water, and litter boxes accessible. The most important thing you can do for your cat is to make sure all of its needs are met. This means food, water, and litter need to be well maintained and accessible. You should always make sure your cat is eating enough food and stays hydrated. Some cats tend to dislike still water, so you might want to consider a pet fountain. Otherwise, focus on getting your cat its hydration through its food. Wet cat food formulas typically have a high water content which helps with your cat's hydration needs. You should also feed your cat at scheduled times. For most cats, two meals a day is sufficient. Just avoid free feeding your cat. If it's difficult for you to maintain a regular feeding schedule, you can always consider an automatic feeder. As for litter boxes, you should always have one litter box per cat plus an extra box. For example, if you have only one cat, you should have two litter boxes. This provides your cat with more autonomy and accessibility. Your furry friend will thank you with purrs. Number two, keep the litter box clean. Proper hygiene is essential to keep a cat happy and healthy. While cats keep themselves clean for the most part, it's important to keep up your end as well. You really don't want your cat to be grossed out by the litter box and hesitate to use it. After all, don't you avoid gross bathrooms too? With that said, you should be scooping your cat's litter box at least once a day. But litter box maintenance doesn't end there. To really keep it clean, experts recommend fully changing the litter and deep cleaning the box at least once a month. If you have a very busy lifestyle, you might consider a self-cleaning litter box. If you want the best of the best, we're big fans of the litter robot. Automatic litter boxes like the litter robot take away the hassle of scooping your cat's litter, saving you time. But the most important part is that it provides your cat with a clean place to relieve themselves every day, truly maximizing hygiene. If you want to check it out, we'll have the link to our review of the litter box 4 in the description box. Number 3. Keep your cat entertained. While cats are more self-sufficient than other pets, they still require plenty of attention and care. Boredom makes for an unhappy cat, and it can also have negative effects on a cat's health. That's why it's important to provide plenty of ways to keep your furry friend entertained. This is especially important if you have a busy schedule and are often out of the house. Puzzle feeders and interactive toys are great ways to keep your cat entertained and mentally stimulated. Cats are very motivated by food, and you can use this to your advantage to keep your cat occupied. Try using kibble and treats to incentivize your cat to solve puzzles and play. This will lead to your cat being more healthy, mentally sharp, and active in the long term. You should also provide your cat with easy access to places where it can look out of windows and observe. Cats are very curious animals, and they love to sit and watch the outside world. Whether it be birds, squirrels, people, or other scenic changes, cats are fascinated by windows. Just make sure to keep your window securely latched and locked so your cat can only observe the outside world from the safety of your home. Number 4. Schedule Playtime In the same vein as number 3, you should set aside time every day to play with your cat. Playtime is essential to cats as it prevents boredom, keeps them stimulated, and provides exercise. If there is one thing cats love more than playing, it is playtime with their favorite human. While interactive toys and self-directed play can be enjoyable for cats, there is no substitute for quality time with their person. That's why you should make these play sessions a regular routine. After all, most cats need about 30 minutes of exercise per day. Feather toys, plush mice, and toy balls are just a few of many feline favorites. Even if it's just for 20 minutes, playing with your cat daily will have positive benefits on your relationship. Number 5. Brush your cat regularly While cats are excellent at grooming themselves, regular brushing is necessary to keep its coat glossy and healthy. Plus, cats tend to enjoy being brushed. It'll be a relaxing experience for your feline friend as well as a beneficial one. Generally speaking, with short-haired cats, you should brush their coats at least once a week. This frequency should be increased to a few times a week for medium-haired cats and every day for long-haired cats. Brushing regularly will help prevent tangles and matting. It will also remove excess oils and make the coat shiny and bright. Just be sure to brush your cat softly and not too rough. You want brushing to be a peaceful experience that your cat looks forward to, rather than one it associates with pain or stress. Get a soft brush and lightly stroke the fur, making sure not to tug or pull. Don't forget to brush the head, behind the ear, the backs of the legs, the chest, and the armpits. These are areas where it is harder for your cat to groom itself, so you may need to pay extra attention. Number 6. Provide your cat with hiding places 
Cats enjoy small, enclosed spaces that they can relax or sleep in. With this in mind, you should provide your cat with enough space that it can hide and get away from the rest of the world. This could be an enclosed cat bed, an open cat carrier, or simply an open box. Regardless of what it is, your cat should have at least one space that it can retreat to and be alone. Typically, cats like this space to be dark, enclosed, and secure. It is important to ensure that your cat always feels safe in your home. Providing a safe hiding space is one of the best ways to ensure this. Number 7. Provide areas for your cat to climb. If there is one thing cats love, it's being high up. Cats are known for getting as much leverage as possible, climbing bookshelves and even the refrigerator. If you have ever found your cat on the fridge, let us know in the comments section. To prevent your cat from knocking over your things or potentially getting hurt, you should provide places that it can safely jump and climb. These may be designated cat shelves or a cat tower. Your cat should have areas it can jump to to be able to hang out at different heights and scale up and down the sides. This gives your furry friend more freedom and the ability to entertain itself. Number 8. Monitor your cat's health. Cats are notorious for hiding pain and adverse health symptoms. This can make it fairly difficult for cat owners to detect when something is wrong. Because of this, it is essential to know your cat's normal behaviors and tendencies so you'll be able to notice a change. If your cat is acting more withdrawn, not eating, or sleeping excessively, it's time to book an appointment with your veterinarian. On that note, you should be visiting your vet for yearly checkups to make sure that your cat is in good health. You should also keep your cat up to date on all shots and flea or heartworm treatments, even if you have an indoor cat. You should also monitor your cat's weight. If you notice your cat suddenly losing or gaining weight, be sure to consult your vet as it could be due to underlying health conditions. You should also take note of any other changes in your cat's appearance, such as hair loss, rashes, dental issues, eye or ear discharge, and so on. Being observant is critical when it comes to monitoring your pet's health, especially since many health issues can go undetected if you're not paying attention. Number 9. Allow your cat to exercise its hunting instincts. Cats are natural-born hunters, so many of their hunting instincts remain. That's why it's good to provide your cat with an opportunity to get out their energy and exercise their natural hunting instincts. Many people attempt to suppress these instincts, and sometimes cats can express them in destructive ways. For example, they may destroy furniture, scratch and tear things up, and knock stuff over. However, this can easily be prevented by providing your cat with the appropriate outlets to get out their hunting urges. Cats love scratching, and scratching posts redirect them from scratching your furniture. You should also get your cat some toys that mimic prey, like a toy mouse on a string or feather toys. These toys provide your cat with a way to get out all of their hunting desires without causing real damage. This way, you'll keep your cat happy and content without sacrificing your furniture. Number 10. Treat your cat. Every cat deserves an extra bit of love now and then. You should occasionally reward your cat just for being a positive addition to your life with a treat. It's important to appreciate your cat, and a great way to do this is by giving your cat something special. Whether it be a yummy treat, some extra cuddles, or a new toy to play with, your cat is sure to appreciate the extra love. Treating your cat every once in a while is a great way to reinforce and strengthen your relationship. It will also make your cat feel special and loved. It's important, however, to not spoil your cat too much with edible treats. Too many treats can be unhealthy for your cat. Even though you may be overflowing with love for your cat all the time, keep their treat intake at or below 10% of their daily calorie intake. Instead of too many treats, give them a chin rub or a new toy every once in a while. Number 11. Spend time with your cat. One of the best ways to show your cat you love them is to simply spend time with them. Some cats aren't very physically affectionate, so they show their affection simply by existing in the same room as someone they care about. It is a great idea to reciprocate this action to show your cat that you also care for them. If you're going to study, read, or relax, consider sitting in the same room as your cat. Even if you aren't interacting directly with your cat, it knows and appreciates your presence. Though cats are more independent than other pets, they still experience loneliness. But loneliness can easily be avoided by spending time together, even with something as simple as just sitting in the same room. Now we've gone over the list, it's time for Cat of the Week. This video's Cat of the Week is Marley. His guardian says, Marley is an inquisitive six-month-old tabby kitten whom I adopted from a family moving to another state. He is exceptionally smart and high energy. A cat DNA test revealed he is part Norwegian forest cat and part Maine Coon, which explains why he is already 10 pounds and still growing fast. He's my best friend. Congratulations Marley, keep being possum. To enter your cat for a chance to be featured, visit the entry link in the description box below. So, do you always do these things for your cat? Let us know in the comments below. Also, if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up because it helps other cat lovers find our content. 
Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you next Catterday for another video.